Hello. In this video, I'm going to step through some of the features of our in-contact Microsoft Dynamics Serum Essentials Integration Package. Click to dial, screen pops, and basic call logging are featured in the Essentials Package. In the upper left-hand corner, I'm already logged into the in-contact agent. To the right, I have Microsoft CRM 2013 online open, and I'm on a contact record. The business phone number shown in this field is actually my desktop VoIP phone, and I'm going to be using my cell phone as the agent leg in this example. For click to dial on any configured phone number screen, all I have to do is click the number, and a call is placed. Right now, my agent leg is connecting. I'm going to answer my agent leg, and the number to will be dialed to my desktop VoIP phone. You can see it's coming in now. Hello. This is a Microsoft Dynamics CRM and in contact click to dial demonstration. The call was placed. A marquee popped open showing that we can pass CRM data into the in contact platform in the marquee. I'm showing what number was dialed the name of the person who is dialed using the full name inside of CRM and also the unique ID for this contact. We've also created an activity, a new phone call, outgoing and to the correct person where an agent could enter a note. And I'll click OK and I'm done logging my call. That window is created automatically on clicking the phone number. Now I'm going to show you an inbound phone call. I'm going to go to the contacts list. Currently I'm on the contacts view and I'm going to show screen pop on an inbound call. I'd like to point out that I have two records entered into CRM with the same business phone number and it happens to be the phone number of my desktop VoIP phone which I'm going to dial from. So that number is going to show up as the Annie and will be searched for inside of CRM. I also have a third number here which is close but the nine at the very beginning is different so that shouldn't pop in our search result. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my desktop VoIP phone and I already have my point of connection entered. I'm going to click call. Hello, please press 1 at any time to speak to a test agent. I'm going to press 1 to go into the queue. You can see I was available so I already have an inbound contact. I'm going to minimize my desktop phone. I have an incoming call. I can answer the agent. Now link. connected. And I could ask, am I speaking to Jim or am I speaking to Conrad? You, both of the contacts have been shown. If I'm not talking to Jim or Conrad, I can create a new contact right here. Or because I'm con talking to Conrad, I can just click on the Conrad link. And as you can see, the that particular contact has opened. The screen pop happened. I'm able to see any uh, resolved or recently opened cases related to the contact. I can also see whether they have an entitlement uh, where they would get a certain level of service. I can see previous calls inside of CRM. Had there only been one match in the CRM system to the Annie on the inbound call, this record would have popped up right away. In this example, we've shown a simple scenario. Many additional screen pop scenarios are possible, including, but not limited to, opening leads, cases, and accounts. The caller ID search can also be replaced with other criteria entered in the IVR by a caller, such as a case or account number. It is also possible to open a new note or phone call entry record at the same time as the CRM record screen pop with linkage already created. Thank you for your time. If you have any questions or would like additional information, please reach out to Customer Dynamics.